Hello Zebra Herd, welcome back to Fall Guys. Today we're taking a look at another seasonal outfit. This is the second outfit you get throughout the season. It is the rookie outfit, which is just sort of like this athletic kind of sportswear with the headband and the sports shorts and tank top and stuff. So you got the top and the bottom right here. Um, I'm also using the face circle pattern and the coral blue coloring, but just because I think it worked pretty well, I think it looks pretty nice. So yeah, with that being said, we're going to just sort of hop in. We're also going to be trying our best to get the level 19 at the least, but our goal is eventually level 22 so that we can unlock the hot dog costume showcase soon as well and on top of that if we could somehow just like with the pigeon episode win two rounds today i would be splendidly happy because that would mean we'd have enough to unlock the chili costume i might play a little bit between episodes uh <laughs> i guess we're having a server connection error here so whenever we find a round that connects us let's get started playing with the rookie okay so it's time to race to the finish here we know this one Shouldn't be too big of a deal. And look, I mean, we have our athletic gear on. We're ready just to get sweaty, get working here, and hopefully get some first place finishes. We're knocking people off. We're super competitive. If there was ever a time to win a couple of rounds, it's in an episode like this, right? We're already ready to get all sweaty. <laughs> that rhymed. Okay, come on, push this, push this, that's it. Yeah, I guess you don't wanna focus on the ones in the center because that's where the most of the fighting is happening. So we might not be in the lead, but we're pretty close to it. And now things are getting even a little crazier. Oh my, whoop, okay, we're fine. Ah, okay, okay. Keep dodging. There we go, there we go, we're fine. Yeah, there's somebody way out in the front, but we're not too far behind them. Okay, excuse me, sir. Are you gonna bump into that? You won't. So we got like fifth place there. Pretty good to start things off with. It's on the top 20%, so that's good. I am really not willing to let anything go here. Last episode, we even played an extra round, and I still could not get anywhere close to a win. So we'll have to see if that changes today because I need those crowns for that second half of the chili outfit or we're gonna be in trouble. I'll just have one half of a chili outfit. We'll have really anything to showcase with that. So we'll have to wait and see. But like I said, we're also trying to earn up the points so that we can unlock the hot dog outfit. If we run out of outfits to showcase, I might play a little bit between episodes so that I can unlock outfits to showcase to you guys at some point. Because I always, you know, you know me, I always like to have a purpose to every episode. I don't just like to just play without sort of you know, something to showcase in the episode. That's just sort of how I like to organize my videos. So that would be the goal. <laughs> um, and if I don't have anything to showcase, then I might as well uh, just play between episodes to earn things up. Okay, so we're playing Jinx. This has suddenly become a very common game mode for me. And we'll just try to survive being unjinxed for as long as possible. And what's nice, if I stand right here, I can keep track of every Jinx player if I don't fall like a silly person. I can't see now. Okay, guys, move. You're on my team and you're actively getting in my way. <laughs> Unless this guy gets Jinx. But for right now, like I can see all of the potentially Jinx players and just sort of scout it out. Like this guy's coming over and that's scary and everything, but he decides to turn away. Wait, hey, don't push. What are you doing? I'm on your team. <laughs> They're supposed to be helping me, not hindering. What are you doing? This guy is secretly working for the blue team. I don't like it. Oh no, 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 no. Ah, oh, I got jinxed. It was all the, the pineapple guy. All right, well, he's a secret spy working for the blue team. But they are lower than we are. Oh, you're mine. You're jinxed now. So is everybody over here. Oh wait, this guy's not. We got a blue pigeon. Can I get him? Come on, people, move it. Oh. Ah, I made the jump, but... Okay, there's two guys up here. Oh, oh no, he jumped over me! You get back here! They're too good. Luckily, we're still in the lead, but for how long? We need to get these guys. Where do they go? I'm gonna find him. Oh, okay, here's a ninja. Oh, I almost got him with that too. Move, you're grabbing me. No! Ah, oh, come on, team, we had the lead and everything. Yikes, I'm still furious that the pineapple guy did me in. <laughs> he really was working for the blue team the whole time. Well, that is not the start I was looking for, but that's just sort of what happens in team games. You really can't expect much. Um, well, there's 60 extra fame, it's something. It's definitely something. Uh, let's get back into it. <laughs> Hopefully that was just a good warm up. Okay, so here we go again. Starting from the beginning again. Everybody's just sort of falling down this hill a little bit. Let's jump for that one. Yeah, right now there's so many people. Oh my gosh, and I'm not paying attention to that. I was so focused on what's going on in front of me. Whoop. 
There we go. We're fine, we're fine. This one's gonna jump right about there. I made it, but people got knocked into me. Okay, excuse me, everyone. Uh, now this is the unfun part about, ah, uh, whirly gig. Okay, come on, let me up, let me up. I might not be able to make this one. I don't know, we're starting to reach a bit of a bad luck spell with Fall Guys right now. Let's hope that doesn't last forever. We gotta turn it around sooner or later, right? Because like I said, last episode was the first in a several episode streak where we, well, the last, our, our win streak ended. I was getting one win per episode. That guy pushed me. <laughs> Get out of here. Um, and then last episode was the first time in a while I had not gotten a win. There we go. Okay, this is the tough part, but what's so tough about it is that a lot of people ignore that, and then everybody gets in the way, out of my way. Okay, so there's lots of people around here, but <laughs> we're able to qualify pretty good. I just wanna make sure we're in that top 20%, and we definitely were. So now more of them are starting to pour in. Yeah, this is this is one that takes forever, because there's always a good chunk of people who just really struggle to get to the end. They're trying, though, they're definitely trying. Well, there's that round over. <laughs> I always love seeing them fall after it's already over. Um, so we go from 55 down to 42. Let's try to get through the second round. We've been dying a lot, or I guess being eliminated a lot in the second round. There's just some weird bad mojo happening. Let's see what happens this time. Maybe not. Rollout, okay. I typically succeed in rollout. Let's hope that happens this time. So we got plenty of players to compete with here. Only 17 out of this group need to be eliminated. I just gotta make sure I'm not one of those 17. Lots of pigeons running around. So since I haven't asked you guys yet, what are your thoughts on the uh, rookie outfit? Do you think it's uh, worth all of its effort? I think it's a pretty cool outfit, but pretty basic. But sometimes I feel like in a game with a lot of costumes, you wanna have some basic costumes mixed in because they can be great base elements for making your own custom costume if there's like a certain element you want to have. Having just sort of certain roles like an athletic guy can be pretty useful. So I do appreciate it for that. I do think it is the least exciting costume out of the possible season rewards. So, I mean, that's sort of a good thing for us because that means you can only go up from here, right? <laughs> so that's cool. Um, so we'll definitely be checking out all the other ones. Like I said, we're trying to earn up the hot dog costume at the moment. I definitely think we'll be able to get to the level where we can get the bottom of it. But the top of it might take a couple more episodes. So we'll have to wait and see. Oh my, oh my. Uh, angling here is not what I want. Only two more people have to be eliminated. Once again, I'm desperately trying to make sure that that one person that's left isn't me. Oh my, oh my. That's very steep and we qualified, awesome. Well, that's all I wanted to see. So what's going on in round number three, now that we have survived the treacherous round two? We'll have to wait and see. For right now, 17 people were disqualified, meaning there's 25 left. But yeah, were you able to earn up this Fall Guys uh, athletic uh, rookie costume? I forgot the name of it. Uh, throughout season one, do you think it was worth the effort? I would love to hear. Jump Club, all right. Jump over the spinning beam and avoid falling into this line. I think I can do it. There's no falling platforms for this one anyways, so. As long as nobody gets in the way. And this is another one where you just have to out-survive everybody else. So we're going to jump over that. And I could just keep running like this, but you gotta be careful, because if we make a mistake and bump into somebody, that could be a problem. But a lot of people just elect not to jump. Oh my gosh, see that's what I'm talking about. That's a problem, that's a problem. This isn't fair, this isn't fair, this isn't fair at all. Ah, uh, come on, what do I do? I can't do anything, I can't move. Oh uh, no, this isn't fair, everybody was in the way. Oh my gosh, the bad luck we have been getting recently. It's too much to bear. All right, well as you can see, we get 98 points. Still not enough to uh, to get a level up. Jeez, what do I gotta do to get a win here? Okay, we're back at the whirly gig again. Oh man. Well, when the rough gets going, 
uh, I guess to go and get rough. We, we just gotta keep trying. The competition is getting steeper. I'm sure more people are getting better at the game as time moves forward. Ah. But there's still a lot of luck involved. And uh, like I said, we've been getting particularly unlucky the last couple of episodes. Or at least just this episode and last episode. The episode before that, we won twice in a row. So maybe I had to pay it forward. I'm glad that we didn't get knocked over the wall there. Oh boy, it's all about staying in front or behind the crowd. I mean, you don't want to stay behind it because then too many people will complete the level before you. So that's where it gets tough. You gotta stay in front of the crowd, but the crowd's in the way of doing that, right? Most of the time. Ooh, we made it, we made it. We're fine. Now this is the tough part. Not everybody likes to take this risk, but you know what? Call me a risk taker, it worked out. Now this part's easy, right? As long as, once again, nobody else gets in the way. Oh, I thought, okay, I made the jump still. Jump, go, not bad, all right. Hey everybody, <laughs> boom, get seventh place, pretty good. And now we just gotta wait for everybody else to pour in. Okay, so there we go. The whirly gig always takes so long, so I just didn't even bother saying anything. All right, so once again, Round two, maybe round two isn't as bad as round three. <laughs> we'll have to get past both of them. So I think I'm going to do, do more than two tournaments today, or three tournaments like I normally do, because I need to win. I just, I need to win some so that we can get those crowns. I know that there is a crown reward coming up in the season. So if I could just win one more game and then get that season reward, that'd be enough to get the chili outfit. That would make me happy. <laughs> but in the meantime, what else do we have going on? Right now, it's this one, which usually this is one of the first rounds, not the second, so honestly, I don't mind that too much. These can always still be fun, and they're easier than some other types, so I'll take it. Some people are falling over. I wonder if that's faster. I guess we're gonna find out. Oh, there's a little bouncer there. I didn't realize that. Huh, didn't notice that bounced you. Okay, so we know what to do here. Just gotta push through this, but the whole crowd gets in the way. Everybody, out of the way, move it. Gotta go with the flow. That's it, that's it. Oh, give me a little speed boost. And this is, oh, where things can go south if you're not careful. Okay, that's fine. Yep, ooh, we made it through that pretty clean. Now just trying to move through all the poles. We got it, we got it. And it looks like we're getting a top five finish. Not too bad. And this one doesn't take too long for everybody to pour in. It's a pretty simple one. This guy's holding on to other people, but he ended up knocking himself back, and I think that might have cost him the qualification. Wow. That's why you don't want to do that. He was trying to hold somebody back, and instead, he got held back. And that brings it down to 31. So there's still plenty of room for like a four or three team mini game here. We'll see what we end up dealing with. I don't know, I'm starting to have hesitation towards the team game modes because it just seems like they're not working out too well for me. But it's egg scramble, so we'll have to rely on our team. So there's definitely gonna be a lopsided team because it'll probably be two sets of 10 and then one set of 11. So I don't know who has the smaller team here. I do not have the time to count it up. So we're going in and I'm just hoping we could do something good here. I'm pressing the wrong button. <laughs> I was like, why am I not picking up the egg? Pressing the wrong button. Oh, okay, okay. Don't grab, I'm not a, do I look like an egg to you? <laughs> I don't think so. So there we go. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> Excuse me, sir. Ooh. So, so far we're not losing. We're not winning, but we're not losing. But you know what, I think it's time to go into the red team's area, start taking some of theirs. Oh, one of our yellow guys does have an egg, a golden egg. Okay, I got it out of there. <laughs> no, and then the blue guy goes and pushes it all in. No wonder he's a part of the losing team. He doesn't know what he's doing. Okay, there we go, there we go. Ha <laughs> ha, I got one. Wait a minute, that's our egg. Over there, that golden egg. Don't let the red team get it, they're already winning. Let go of me. There's a whole entourage of blue team members trying to get it now. 
It's mine. It's, no. <laughs> the blue guys are stealing it from each other. This is bad. Oh, this is very bad. Give that back. Excuse me. Pardon me. Come on, I can make it out of here. I can make it out of here. Ugh. Move, <laughs> no. Somehow the blue team is still losing, even with this one golden egg. Okay, that's mine. Oh, come on, dude. Get out of here. I hate when, you, when that happens, when you jump and like the egg gets up there, but you don't, and you just awkwardly sort of start to slide. Ugh, stop. Get out of here. We got 13 seconds left. And the blue team, I got the golden egg, it's mine. Everybody leave me alone, they're chasing me down. Come on, go, 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 ready, whoop. <laughs> there we go. And there we go, that's gonna get us, not the win, but like I said before, a qualification, which is all I desperately need for right now. We can save the winning to the final round, but if I could just get to the final round right now, that'd be fantastic. So as you can see, the blue team goes bye-bye, leaving only 21. So we could have another team game here, three sets of seven. We'll have to wait and see. Or it could be Slime Mountain. Haven't had that in a little while. I would love Slime Mountain. It's Block Party, another one we actually haven't had in a while. Avoid the, the, the moving walls. I will do what I can. There's a lot of guys in here still. A lot of them might end up getting in my way. How crazy would it be if all 20 of them got eliminated and I just won here? I don't think that would ever happen. But the fact that it can is crazy. Uh, don't go that way, what am I doing? Okay, let's get our, our jogging going. That's why we have these uh, wristbands and the headband. So that we can jog around, build up a sweat. <laughs> Should be no problem. Keep going, keep going. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Okay, there were some on that side too. But it's, I thought that some people got eliminated there, but I guess not. Oh, it's moving quick. Okay, this way, this way, this way. Same thing over here. We're leading the pack right now, which is good. As long as I can just sort of, yep, just do that. And this is where it gets scary, because other people, whoa, he almost fell off. You could get in the way of your jump, and then it just sort of sweeps you away. Okay, move it. There we go. Oh no, I want to move out of my way, orange dude. Thank you. We only have 40 seconds left to survive this. Five people have been eliminated already. What are you doing? He tried to grab me, did you see that? That's not cool. Okay, okay, we're fine. Oh, are we fine though? We're fine. Are we? <laughs> I don't know, oh no. Come on, jump, there we go. I'm just glad our character could get up in time. Now that one you definitely need to dive through. <laughs> Oh my goodness, 14 people have been eliminated. Only six of us left. This is definitely gonna be the final round after this. Don't grab me, Mr. Dinosaur. I see the shenanigans you're trying to pull. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, did he just get knocked off for that? No, he didn't, he almost did that. Yay, we survived! Woo! All right. And that definitely is enough for the final round, right? I mean, I guess we could technically have a team game here with six remaining. You're going from 10 to seven. So if it is, it'd be lopsided. So it's probably just gonna be the final right here because we've had final rounds with seven people in it. Oh my gosh. So what's gonna go on? Jump showdown. Okay, the last time I was here didn't work out so well because it just sort of fell apart. You have to sometimes guess depending on how it falls apart. And I tried to make a jump and it just didn't work out. <laughs> Okay, once again, the camera moves in the most unhelpful way. <laughs> and you just have to constantly control the camera to make sure that doesn't happen. And that's silly. We gotta pay attention to which platforms are wiggling. Right now it's the edge platforms, which is so much easier. Yeah, there's a little jumping pole on both sides, which makes it a little bit more complicated than the uh, free-for-all uh, jumping one that's not a final. It'd be interesting if there was a team jumping game where you could just sort of hold on to other players and mess them up that way. Okay, the chances are higher that we're gonna have to be over here. Let's hope that's the case. Nobody, oh, somebody actually has just been eliminated. 
And now that one's falling. Once again, let's hope that the final platform is supposed to be over here. See, isn't this one that could really technically end in a tie? Oh my. See, if this falls, you're kidding me. That cactus held on to me. That is not fair. <laughs> At least he got knocked off too, but like, what a mean thing to do. I don't appreciate it. But yeah, wouldn't this one could technically end in a tie? I'm guessing the purple platform is the one that, actually, well, that's true. There's usually two platforms remaining. So I guess that was the other one. I could have stayed over there and just not had to deal with anybody. That would have been perfect. All right, well, that stinks, but it is what it is. It looks like one of these two people are gonna win. Honestly, I just wanna save our time as much as possible. Let's keep moving. I'll go for one more round today. Got second, 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 and then first place medals. So close to at least getting the hot dog top. So we'll do one more round just for the sake of that. Okay, come on, the final tournament to end them all. Can I just get a win here? That's all I want, I want a win, I want a W. You'd think it wouldn't be so bad, but it really, really is. <laughs> okay, there we go, there we go. Okay, we're just gonna keep going. Ah. Uh... Nice. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Whoa! Oh no! Oh my gosh, that's the first time I fell down here in a while and I am just not getting any good luck. That's okay, we can still make top 40 with this. So can you push me ahead? Thank you, give me a little speed boost. And it looks like, you know, there's a decent crowd in front of us, but not 40 people. I was talking about how easy this one is before. Whoa, whoa, I don't know where that's gonna land, but gotta be careful. But we still made like top 10-ish, yeah, that's good. All right, and plenty of people rushing in for this one. That's, that's fine. Yeah, they, they only have like 10 left. Oh, this, this, this guy better be careful. This guy better be careful. <laughs> oh, he almost lost it. That would have been bad. It's always interesting when you see people who want to taunt at the finish line. There's like big fun of the people who don't make it. And then the, the karma when they get knocked out. <laughs> it's that risky run, right? All right, well, let's hope we can get to the end of a tournament and nobody ruins my chances just out of random acts of spite because that's just something you gotta expect in Fall Guys, is just random, unsolicited acts of pure spite. So what's gonna be round number two? Will it be a team game that will ruin us? Will it be a single player mode? All right, intro, so it's a single one. I mean, I don't mean single player as in lack of multiplayer, I mean as in like a free for all. You're all in it for yourself. Okay, we've survived this one so many times. Why would this time be any different? So it's always 17 eliminated. I didn't know if it was like depending on uh, how many players were in the lobby or whatever, but I think it's just always 17. So I guess that means that, oh my, that we're in trouble right now. That we're in big trouble. That we're in super big trouble. Okay, no, we're fine, we're fine. Um, but I guess that means that you can't really play this game mode if you don't have at least 18 players in the lobby. So there we go, there's some deduction we can make in the future. <laughs> I don't think I'll ever remember that much, but. Already more than half of the players that need to be eliminated are, they're grabbing me again, I'm telling you, it's totally random. But it's definitely spiteful. <laughs> okay. Oh my, I just get so nervous. And sometimes it's easy to sort of cycle through them very quickly like this, but it's not always worth the risk of other people, like I said, just trying to ruin the fun. Is it getting faster? Oh, some of these are definitely rotating faster. I did not realize that could happen. But I guess it might be necessary considering the fact that, oh my, oh my, this stuff is whizzing by now that not many people are getting eliminated right now. Okay, and we qualify, there we go. Woo. 
Round over. So we're going from, you know, whatever we had to 17 less than that. Leaving 24 remaining. Okay, so I, I'm guessing there's probably two to three rounds. I mean, that was the second round, right? So we could have up to three more rounds left over. Very likely. Egg scramble. It's weird because I feel like the last couple of episodes, we started getting rounds or like mini game types that we don't typically get, but now we're getting them all of the time. I wonder if certain these, there's like priority over certain mini games more than others, because now we're getting egg scramble all the time. We used to not get it at all. Either way, can we get it to be another win is the really the only thing I'm worried about. Oh, I see that golden one just hanging out. I got it too, oh, look at me. Golden Egg Deliverer. Which means we're gonna have a big target on our back for people stealing our eggs. I don't like it. Okay, hold on. Okay, don't, you're on my team. <laughs> and they were just trying to grab me. What are you doing, french fries? French fries, what are you doing? Okay, that's mine. Can I deliver, let go, I'm on your team. There. So if we can just play goalie and just give everybody who tries to steal our eggs the hardest time possible, That'd be good. Like you, sir, I can finally be the, the goalie because we're actually in the lead to start things off. Right now it's just one blue duck trying to steal our stuff. Yeah, what do you think you're doing? Oh, but the wolf is coming in as well and he's much speedier, but not speedy enough. Okay, now the red guys are coming in and once again, you guys block that side, I'll block this side. Oh, the yellow guy's still coming in there to deliver more. There we go. Oh, it went flying back up. Oh no, come on, we gotta block that side too. Gotta block that side too. Oh, not happening. I said not happening. Just keep him there. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's still in our net. You got it, french fries. Good job, 30 seconds remaining. Red team is scrambling. Uh, It looks like uh, they're in the, in the last place right now, so definitely I understand why, but. They're really trying right now. They're not really getting too much done. I don't know why the wolf is trying to take it out. Well, maybe he's not. Maybe he's just trying to hold on to it. Let's throw that in. Let's do a little bit of maintenance here. Five seconds remaining. I think we're good then. I'm just gonna hold you there. And it looks like poor old red team is getting eliminated. But hey, we got first place for this one. That's always nice to see. But I wonder if the time of day I'm playing changes the level of competition. Now that I'm thinking about it, when we played and got two wins in a row, that was this morning at like, maybe like 10 a.m. Uh, now I'm playing at 3 p.m. And it's on Saturday too. So I feel like peak player for time is afternoon on a weekend night or weekend after, you know what I mean. Um, so maybe that's why it's a lot tougher now is that some of the more active gamers are out. I guess we'll have to wait and see. For right now though, we just have to survive this. We've survived it in the last tournament. Why couldn't we do it this time, you know? Oh my, oh is this the one where the little walls will pop up shortly after the other ones will? So it makes little rooms that will just push you off. Gotta pay extra attention. So far not too bad, but it's interesting how this is one of the mini games that'll actually vary in what's happening because not many of the mini games will do that. You know, like I was saying, I would love to see Slime Mountain or some of the other ones with just different, the same um, gimmick of obstacles, but in different layouts just to keep it fresh and keep you on your toes. Do the Fall Guys have toes? I don't have toes. Uh, so I, I can only hope they do. I mean, it might depend on the costume, but either way, tangent aside, uh, I wish more of them were like this mini game, where it is a little different every time, so you need to sort of change up what you expect. All right, ready? Ooh. It just adds a bit of intrigue. We did a little flip there. I'd, I'd rather choose not to do a flip, though. It'd be cool if you could control like which direction you're flying in midair and do a little tricks that way, yeah. Whoop, that wasn't too bad. Oh my. Whoa! No! 
Oh, you are kidding me. They pushed me off. Oh, man, I just can't catch a break. Well, as you can see, we will still get enough to unlock the first half of Mr. Hot Dog. I will play between episodes so that I can try to get some extra crowns so that we can unlock the chili outfit because I still need two more crowns. And it just, I like the idea of there being costumes behind crowns which you need to win to earn and no other way can you get them besides or, uh, uh, season rewards. What I don't like is a combination between that and it being timed. So it's like I'm just panicking. <laughs> But I will try a little bit harder, and hopefully we will have more costumes in the next episode of Fall Guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.